Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you this type of trendy Photoshop design which is for the social media marketing. You can use it for the Facebook, you can use it for the Instagram and other where. So let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. Going to the file at first and going to the new options from here i'll take the 2000 pixel and 2000 pixel and circle social media post i'm just using the initial for the convenient and hit the create button you're getting the blank layer that's good going to the solid color and choosing a little bit of this type of thing that means db db and db and hit the ok button that's good and now time to use this circle this circle and circular work at first and we'll do other work so how to do the circular work that's pretty much easy making the circle by pressing shift and hold it make the circle like a orange type color so i'm using this type of color that's good and after that we'll make the restylize of the layer before that press ctrl or command a and make this one middle of the artboard that's good and press ctrl or command d for the deselect that's good right press and restylize the layer and now we'll just take a guideline a guideline and after that just rectangular marquee tool and delete this one select after selecting that just press the delete options so this one is deleted and now we'll just do divide okay that's good press ctrl or command j press ctrl or command t right press and flip horizontal and make this one like that so we're keeping this one we'll work with that later okay now in the middle of this we'll take another circle which is the ellipse tool so press the shift and hold it making the circle like that and after that press ctrl or command a making this one middle of the artboard that's good and you can make this one a little bit of bigger actually press ctrl or command t make this one a little bit of bigger like this okay that's fine and now we'll use the stroke thickness and stroke color white stroke thickness like 10 pt that's good and make this one ash color that's good and press ctrl command j and press ctrl command t and after that uh, we'll make this one uh, like a smaller so like a 50 percent or 80 percent so okay 80 percent that's good so same color uh, that's why you are not watching that before that and after that press ctrl command t and make this one a little bit of upper side that's good and this one press ctrl command t make this one a little bit of downside that's good so press the press this shift and hold it and that's good and now we'll use um, uh, like remove the stroke from here we'll use uh, like a city over there uh, actually in this portion we'll use the stroke in this ellipse that means the smaller ellipse we don't use so making the different color it will help us out this color will be like that that's fine press ctrl command t making this one a little bit smaller okay that's fine okay in this ellipse we'll import a photo by pressing over there place embedded options and we have a city photo we already used this one in last tutorial okay that's fine and i'll provide you the download link in my video description that's good and a little bit of downside that's fine and right press and create clipping mask and after that press ctrl or command uh, like shift command and a that means the camera filter from here vibrance and the saturation will be like that okay this orange color circle i'll make this one multiply that's fine okay press ctrl or command t make this one a little bit of bigger that's good and now we'll write down something over there like a um, social media agency or digital marketing agency whatever and this should be like uh, 16 
actually 16 is too small 24 and gap will be like uh, 27 that's fine okay hit the tick button and making them uh, this all the things will be white color okay that's fine and taking those thing into the middle of this artboard so we should use the gap between two letters that is 25 is good okay and press ctrl or command a making this one middle of the artboard that's fine we should make this one proper white okay it will be stand out actually that's nice and this opacity of the fill color will be 95 okay that's good and we'll use another city when the place embedded and using another city like this okay make this one bigger and make this one downside only the city will be show over there okay and the opacity of this only five or six percent okay main thing is that going to the camera filter going to the filter and camera filter again we will make this one vibrance and the saturation down that means the black and white photo this one is the easiest way so another circle over there so press ctrl or command j press ctrl or command t making this one like smaller actually downside and we have to make this one clear create clipping mask and we should have to make the stroke that is off and the downside of this press ctrl command t that's good making this one smaller like this okay that's good and press alter option button to copy this one and place over there okay that's fine and we'll use some like uh, polka dots so going to the file and place embedded options i already downloaded this one those are the png so using the polka dots making this one smaller that's fine and i have to make this one into the upper side of all layer by pressing the uh, shift command third bracket opening right press and restyle as the layer and i'll take only three or four lines one two three four so rest of the thing i'll delete this one okay right press and blending options making them into the color overlay and color will be white that's good this white color I'm going to the move tool and placing over there press ctrl or command t and making this one smaller and middle of this circle that's good press the enter or hit the enter and press alter option button you can copy this one so our this decoration is done so we have to make those things into the middle of that but making this one in a group and making this one middle of that but that's fine so this name is circle c i r c l e so in future if we need to edit this one this one is the easiest way to find out where our particles and everything will be okay now time to add some particles or triangle like that so upper side of this taking another blank layer and going to the paint tool p from the paint tool and in a free hand you can make the triangle like that right press and make selection and hit ok so choose the color from this color picker and option or alter till it so you are getting the like a triangle over there and freehand triangle like this that's good right press and make selection and hit ok and in this case i'll make the ash color and alter option button and delete that's good and press ctrl or command d that's good and in this portion so freehand triangle right press and make the selections and hit ok so in this portion i'll use the same color as color okay and another triangle like this that's good right press and make selection and hit ok and choose the color like orange color and hit ok and option and delete button so you are getting so you can use another triangle over there okay that's good make selection and hit ok and i'll use the this type of color okay that's good and you can use the another ash color like this right press make selections and hit ok and choose the color ash or 
option and delete button that's good so those are the particle and you can use that that's good and now your logo and tagline so this one is the one text control command v so i'll use into this portion okay that's fine and in this portion that is the icon you can download this icon easily from the png or you can write down by the help of the text tool easily so these things and in the right side social media icon i am using here some icons from the uh, like a vector you can copy those things Ctrl command c and you can change up the color before using that and Ctrl command v actually in this file Ctrl command v and making them pixels making them smaller and proper alignment according to this and hit the tick button okay in the downside we can make a round rectangle like this so that's fine and here is the write-up that is the get code copying this one control command v and control command t actually uh, here this text control command c and another blank layer control command v before that you have to take the text tool and control command v okay press control command t for the transform and make this one is smaller not too much yeah according to this box okay you can make it zoom and press enter so this rectangle you can make this one more round uh, i'm using here 20 pixels that's good and make the text into middle of the like this so this one should be one group and making them proper alignment okay that's fine in this options you are getting the location address and just making this one copy and paste that's good and making this one 12 pt that's good or like uh, 9 pt is good that's good and we'll place underneath of this so all the steps i'll make this one into the group so this one company logo and triangle it will be group you can provide the name logo okay and the call that is good and rectangle and get code and the dhaka okay making this one like a location okay that's good and other things so all the steps should be into the middle of the artboard so this one should be middle of the uh, alignment uh, or right alignment that's good and this logo and everything so i'm copying this one logo and everything okay that's good making this one group and text and press ctrl command a making this one middle of this okay before using that you have to make this one proper alignment according to this uh, one so le let's check this one that is proper alignment okay that's good and our all the stuffs is ready and now make this one into the jpeg version so making this one into the jpeg options and save it out so our jpeg is ready and i have a mock-up this type of mock-up so you can download mock-up from any sort of uh, download options from there and just place over there you can go to the file and place embedded options and import this one and you can stretch by pressing the shift and hold it. Uh, it the stretching is prohibited in the designing but in this perspective mode you can stretch this one because of this one is the perspective mode and it will uh, just give you the proper view according to this isometric uh, shape and here is the background option double press in the background portion and you can change up the background according to this or you can make like this or like this or the white portion over there and you can draw another like a uh, extra shape like this so this shape color could be according to this 
it will give you extra dimension and the like feel over there which is the professional look and you can make decoration and you can upload this one and now you can save this one into the jpeg so going to the jpeg options and giving the mockup to and save your jpeg so after saving the jpeg that image you can upload in your portfolio in your social media and in your client as well so this one is the whole way of how to make the social media post design by this which is the trendiest one in this time and you can follow my steps by this technique so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any sort of questions query requests please do comment on my video comment section until the next video is yes, when i'm signing out stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers and bye bye